It may really seem like summer's arrived for students with school over and a warm sunny day. Green Bay is among area cities that have started their supervised playground programs. Today marking the beginning of 10-week programs for children of all ages. But while some children had a chance to hit the playground only, others were already back in the classroom. Fox 11's Kelly Schlick shows us how summer school has become something fun. We'll go over um, the nuclear radiation and radioactive decay. These students at Bayport High School are getting schooled in chemistry this summer. Walking down the hallways in this class you get and seeing how you're older, you do get a lot of looks that you're kind of retaking a class that you might have failed. But they're not here because of bad grades. Doing this class, you don't have to take regular chemistry in, in the school year. So that places you a year ahead in the chemistry field. It gives lots of students an opportunity for enrichment activities to try something they've never tried before. Whether enrichment courses like abstract painting or college prep courses like accelerated chemistry, students say summer school gives them opportunities to do things they don't have time for during the school year. Doing this just kind of frees up your schedule. In the summer it's six weeks compared to nine months. So you cover a lot and you only have to worry about one class. Districts say popularity of enrichment classes is growing across the area. Howard Swamico says 3,500 students will take a class this summer. In Green Bay, the largest area school district, up to 9,000 students will participate in summer classes. Green Bay Public Schools say most classes focus on fun while learning, rather than college prep. We do offer some electives, um, mostly it's, it's phi ed, and a lot of those students will try and take those courses in the summer to free up their schedules so that they can take the advanced placement courses during the school year. Students say while well, a summer of sleeping in and freedom is hard to give up, taking class now might pay off in the future. Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News. We checked around today and some school districts told us that they still have openings for summer school sessions and their advice to parents is simply check with your local school to see what's available.